Listen, man, we got um, TFC 10.5. Somebody makes a noise. Anybody in the world. Um, yeah, yeah, I'll make yes, a one. Hey. Yeah, yeah. Hey. <laughs> On my left, uh, the nigga with two names introduce yourself. Oh. He's talking to you. Hello. Right, fire, one hundred percent. I'm not right. <laughs> ego, man, big ego in this bitch, man. I don't give a fuck about curses. Let's get it. Yo, oh my crazy. god, that's crazy. That's that is crazy. Uh, I, I, didn't even, I didn't even. Somebody, I didn't even. I didn't even write for call, this shit. Somebody call has a tail right now. I literally didn't. Tails. It's tails. Uh, what you want to do, ego? <sighs> Let me listen to him real quick. All right, Chris, go ahead and write. All right, I said. I just want y'all to know, Bibbidi Bop, Boopity Scott, I'm better than Ego. Let's get it. Time. Time, man. Uh, bottom of the round. No, you're not. You big ego. I saw you, big ego. Uh, fight back if, if possible. This nigga don't yeah, fucking ruin man. the battle. This nigga don't ruin the fucking battle. First, with the big ego. <sighs> I'm mad at you, nigga. I'm mad at you. But I'm feeling in my element to show you etiquette. So let's go ahead and start out this round with a little bit of cursed character development. Okay? Because you said. Bob and weave on a nigga head like a ghetto black bitch. See, that one extra word showed me what you really mean. So let's crack a fiend. You were never taught to follow suit. Tap into your roots. I'm gonna call a spade a spade. Cause this nigga and this coon had a resort to cutting a black queen. Who the fuck raised you, pussy? Hmm? This Uncle Tom ass motherfucker was never one for the protest because you really hate to see niggas unchained riding off in a sunset. And it's so bad. Like Sam Jack, you're so trash because your first thoughts would have been, hey, the fuck that nigga up there doing on that nag? But let's not go ahead and get personal <laughs> just yet. All right? Because yeah. you already seem upset. I see you smiling, nigga. Shut the fuck up because you're really about to see your death. All right? Because mm. one wave of the hand will get you cleaving this mantle since you want to be a king curse. You're not God. The first cut going to make them open wide. Two more cuts will take this cancer out the league because you've never been beneficial, bitch. You just look benign. Up the mm. oh, no, let's put that Nina aside. I keep that piece by the wayside just in case I fuck up the first shot like a concubine. And you're borderline in line for that much needed corner time. I'm bringing back problems for cats and believe. I'm trying to see if this pussy even got a spine. There were more cuts that I had planned when the domain expand, but yo dumb ass already walked into the malevolent shrine but fuck this shit let's push the line because what the fuck do i look like even really losing to this geek you fucking dweeb how the hell were you in the army getting war ready but you can't get aggressive when you in a battle with me let's debrief i studied the art of war and it was plain to see that if you know yourself and know your enemy you need not fear the results of a hundred battles but peep if you know yourself and not the enemy then for every hundred victories, you will suffer defeat. So I tapped into negative curse energy and turned it into a positive piece, killing with ease. Y'all ain't even see the punch. Nah. Mm -hmm. Y'all just saw me black flash. See how easy it was for me to reverse curse techniques? You dumb as fuck. And you thought you mm -hmm. could line me up over the smallest right. substance? Shut the fuck up, bitch. You just bumping gums. Fuck this cunt up a gun. This blick got a Kyoga kick. Every hit made the room shift. I was cursed to drum. Try to run. Bullets rip through tissue and pop a lung. All he gonna say is, ah, sh shit, fuck. Because a method is to reverse curse spirits. I ain't with the curse speech, but I sure know how to make a bitch talk in tongues. Let's go. All Can right. I get witness? Because uh, I peeped the animosity right. that you have for me, so I can't dismiss it. Load the smith. And nobody going to know what you look like before the shot, but I bet they know your fate from the after image. I hate these niggas. Talking crazy mm -hmm. on the net till they get met with the steel like loss prevention. So think twice before my blood starts <laughs> boiling. Where I'm up that 357 over the 223 if I ever feel hypertension. Tweak the shot because I peaked the plot. Like you that. try to. Right. I said tweak the shot because I peaked the plot. You try to hold a star back like Rodon so the shotgun makes some red bloom out of curse back like Scarlet Rot. Fuck this twat and let's make an example <laughs> out of you. Your last battle, it was okay. Got an ample amount of views, a little over 3K, but we all know it's. <laughs> <laughs> 
that fuck this toy. Let's make an example out of you. Your last battle, right. your last battle was okay. Uh, did an ample amount of views, a mm-hmm. little over 3K. 3K. But we all know it's fake, so what I'm trying to say, it's a parallel. Bot views to be the cover of the league just to find out that he's two-faced. Nah, that ain't that your last man? Nah, let's go ahead and wait, because real niggas peep the fake shit. We don't believe you to be true, because your round was different against Morning Star. Now that I think about it, you might have bought that too. Oh. <laughs> you might have you might have bought that too but really they had us battle first tonight to set the tone and being abstract is something that i embody one round from a stick and put a hole through this bitch like i'm playing hockey you must not think i was gonna come to play nigga but now nah, i'm gonna still catch this homie because they got me up in here screaming fuck morals because i'm not the type of nigga to pass up on the first body. that was light i know you could take okay. a punch in this little altercation I just wanted to see what I could do with the throwaways, but now I think it's time for that good character assassination. And it's about to look bad on me because I don't really think you deserve it, and I got to leave you leaking. But I'm going to still stomp this bitch out on Cam. He get the Cassie treatment. Don't need a reason. And this next angle, I'm going to teach you about something called cause and effect. Cause you got scammed by rock and affected your whole fucking family with generational debt. Just accept <laughs> that your game... <laughs> Uh-huh. This what next angle, <laughs> I'm going to teach you about something that I call cause and effect, cause. You got scammed by walking, affected your whole fucking family with generational debt. Just accept that your gambling addiction is bad, but he can't give up the feeling like his first hit of Reefa took a bet with Star and bought into the wrong scheme. So the stock deplete him. Let's talk to this heathen, because there's a truth in your motto. Yeah, as above, so below. Speak the lies, the truth be told, okay, for show. Sure. So I'm going to touch up on that subject, but when your wife left your dumb ass out in the cold, are you ain't do what you supposed mm-hmm. to do but gamble with your livelihood and raise the stakes so much so your wife had no choice but to fold. It goes to show that you couldn't even stop to think about how your actions were affecting your kid. Growing up, seeing pops all night, bags under his eyes, stressing and shit, thinking about sins and wondering how I'm gonna get this money I lost to walk. Man, I gotta catch up on her. You sound like a bitch, but hold up, let it sink in. She can see you're off the deep end. Then you got evicted out your relationship and you moved to Tennessee because you heard that it was a lower cost of living. I think she saw you tweaking, took your kids and with the distance filed a no contact order out on your dumb ass and got government assistance your existence <laughs> is a that's li- actually lie like that though that's why your existence is a lie so fess up and take responsibility because you owe it to your wife every time you made her cry you can see it in your eyes you were feeling it with spite but i could read between the lines so this character can die and now i know why you called yourself two-faced because <laughs> you cursed your family by living a double life that is tough i got this voice in my head telling me to <laughs> stop hard. that nigga done <laughs> that was tough i got this little voice in my ear telling me to stop that nigga done had enough but all i did was raise <laughs> the ante on your bitch ass so go ahead and try to call this bluff Go ahead, curse. You can dispel everything that I said about you and prove that it was all a sham. All you really need to do is put your wife on the cane, but you at work, nigga. That's time, man. Because I know she ain't nowhere to be found. Time, round. Amazing. All right. right. So the judges score the battle 6.7 to zero. Damn. You should have came with something better. Seven to zero. 5.5 5.5 to 1 for the winner of Hell the yeah. decision. Appreciate Not you. Curse, big ego. Let's what? go, man. You got this oh, one, bro. No, nah, bro. There's no uh, way I lost Shout that. out Curse with the, the, I think that's the first time niggas got zeros. Um, <laughs> Hell yeah. Hey, I tried to give you negative. Man, I, I appreciate <laughs> the trying, bro. Nah, that was the first time niggas got zeros. Congratulations to big ego. Uh, ego, I ain't gonna lie, bro. You have the clearest body bag in TFC history. I've never seen literally outside of scores. You are once again break, setting, breaking, breaking the barriers, setting, setting new records. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what are you planning to do uh, going forward from this 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 epic clash where you set records? I don't even know. I'm at a loss for words. 